country. He's like you. He's really a starter. Let's do it. Chris Beard says he feels like he's got seven starters right now. Expect him to play tonight as Christian Bishop. The transfer from Creighton wins the tip. It ends up in the hands of Timmy Allen. The transfer from Utah. And there is Carr to the basket. The Big 12 preseason newcomer of the year. Or the ball if you don't get in him on the defensive end of the floor. Houston Baptist out of the Southland, which is kind of a dirty word in this area after what ACU did a year ago. That's their... HBU has struggled over the last two years, 10 and 44. But Ron Cottrell thinks he's got a good groove here. And that is the man they're high on, Sam Hoffman. That pass gets away. Carr cannot save it. And here comes the Huskies in transition. This is where they think they have an edge. And one. Zayante Boothman. Horns have entered the game. Brock Cunningham. And Jace Febris, kick out to Febris, pick it up where he left off. His de defense again, he uses it to turn it into offense. And then offensively, it's a free-flowing offense that gives everyone an opportunity to score. He's great with the open door cut. and passing the ball. Caught near Amy. That is what Beard stressed coming into the season opener. A lot of motion with this Texas offense. Well, there you see it. You see how the floor is open. He's got five outs and there's nothing around the basket. Febris got it again. Head coach at UT Arlington. Yep. Beard got him to come down here. He's a key piece of this staff. Contested shot with two on the clock. Marcus Carr. That could be the big shot maker for this team. Floor. Because if you give him space, he will look to shoot threes. Here's Bryson Long, a guy that will shoot threes as well. Chris Ball movement here ends up to Deshaun Proctor. He can do here this season in the conference play. So what Texas has, a lot of versatile players like Timmy Allen. Carr to the hoop, set up by Christian Bishop. Guys are like silver you. surfers in the sky. You won't see that this year, but you see a very good team as you see Allen get it back from Carr in the night. Force this and four turnovers. At this point in the game, nice pass by Christian Corso inside to Deshaun Proctor. Hey, Jones, Jones to Carr. Patience, Ramey for three. He's got it. Keep that feistiness. I just want you to add to your game. Rejected. Trey Mitchell with the swat. And that's how you wrap up a possession. A block, defensive rebound for Trey Mitchell. Jones is open in the corner. Another three ball. Program history off balance by Boothman. Timmy Allen rebound and running. All the way. The rim run and the finish. Today. Performance. It was ugly, and eventually, that's what led to the separation with Shaka Smart and Chris Beard coming over from Lovett. Remy's hot. Mitchell on the floor or Carr, you got to get him involved. He can't have this many minutes and not get one look. Jones! How about another? And rewarding these guards who get open. Nice play by Darius Lee to break it up. And then a little Euro step inside from the senior from Harlan. Put that body on you. There's Tordoff. Falls down. Carr and Jones are there. Turnover for HBU. Late pass. Welcome to the box score. Jalen Tyson. Run. If you run and find yourself some space for Texas, your teammates are going to find you. Leave with the drive, a little floater, and a nice shot there by Darius Lee. They've got to remain aggressive, and that's something that Coach Beard stresses. Would that be a blow by there? I wouldn't say it's a blow by, but that is. A little bit of a, look like a mismatch to me, and with Lee driving on Allen, he's got to do a better job of staying directly in front of him. Carr puts it down inside the paint. Got on a minute left in the first half. A three-point game, and then Mitchell at the block of the rebound, and from there, Texas went on the 12-0 run. Boothman, nice scoop shot, rattles it home. Bumped by Corsall is Carr. Courts on the good defense. Late shot clock. Three on the clock. Here's Ramey. Lee falls down. Bishop beats the clock. Ramey got to stay in the fall. And Christian.
Christian Bishop is there to finish. I like to get the ball, but they'll clean it up and be better as they move along. I know it won't work against Gonzaga. Wow. Beard also pointed out as Jones was at five, four, three. They can help these guys that aren't used to playing in a major market like Austin. Understand what's expected. That's expected from Andrew Jones. Yeah, turn. Three from Boothman. Cleaned up the put back by Zion Tordoff. CUSA and Central Arkansas to the Atlantic Sun. Cottrell was sure to point out as Remy hits for three. Third school. Yeah. And so it has just become part of the college game. Nice play by Mitchell. Car eyes up. He's got Ramey. Ramey wants it. Ramey's got it. Courtney Ramey. Uh, Cunningham is an extra possession guy. He'll also uh, talked about Allen being some of the connective tissue. He connects his team too because he doesn't need the ball to score. Speaking of us, I present a shooter as well, 49%. So after Brock Cunningham, 11 days later, it was Andrew Jones and Jace Febris committing to return to play for Chris Beard. And of course, Brock Cunningham, his, who's the do-it-all, what I like to call disruptor, probably one of the best in the conference. So Texas did a great job bringing in transfers, but they also brought back some great players for Lancer's team. Long for the three, and it snaps a 10-0 Texas run. Texas kid. Oh, yeah. With an amazing mustache. <laughs> hey, how about like that finish? Stash. Speaking of Timmy. Get that competitive. Yeah, and I mean, they don't get a lot of publicity, but they've done a nice job. Proctor, a really good debut for HBU. He's done a great job in NBA, so they've had some really good players at TCU. Mitchell keeps it alive and finishes. Mitchell, a little follow-up now, has nine points. For Drew, I mean, that was an epic rebuild as Long launches the three too strong. Lee has been active all night. Left hand, right hand is good. I think it was the first in the history of the tournament where the one seed was knocked off by the bottom seed. Carr leaving it up for Christian Bishop to drop down. Death that double team on Lee. Car inside. Good position by Bishop. And Bishop with the finish. Team to the next level. But that's one thing. It's early. But you can clearly see as Proctor gets the follow and the finish. Deshaun Proctor. And we got a whistle technical foul here. Over on HBU. That's a taunting technical. Finish this probably as a leading scorer here for Texas. And you got to throw him that ball if he gets a guy posted that deep. Askew wants one, drops it, and that is the first bucket as a member of the Texas Longhorns for Devin Askew. This is play a little, huh? Yeah, I mean, how fun has this got to be for him? Be suiting it up for the Longhorns. Tyson to step back. Nice move. It's been a fun night for Mr. Ramey. Nia Yeme hitting two free throws there. 79-41. Tyson, physicality, and Walsh. Shaka did an outstanding job developing NBA guys as Boothman gets the long three. But oh. Benson keeps it alive. Ask you hesitation. Lacombe for three. Welcome to Austin, Texas. Tristan Lacombe. Big time three ball. It's going to be the new Ryan McClure. There you go. Joe Swartz, straight and white side. Jalen Tyson finishing in transition. These transfers here. Tyson saying, I know how to hold it down. There's the steal from Lacombe. Off the head of Benson. He's shooting that. Game. Lacombe. country for old men. Wow. You were encouraging small children to watch that movie. No, I was not. I was encouraging people to... Tyson! Get her finished! <laughs> tell, tell her, runs in, gets him out of the locker room, and I forgot the rest of the story. Yeah, you just don't want to share. Arkansas came back and won that game.
There's Deontay Boothman, preseason second team, all conference selection. He will be big for HBU as they get into the Southland. But tonight is all about Chris Beard. Win number one at his alma mater. And the fans were here showing the appreciation. It's a new era. He's embraced the expectations. He wants to win.